Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be discussing the hatred apparently some people have on me for some odd reason. As you can see from the screenshots here, some people are still salty about a past irrelevant beef that shouldn't have happened in the first place. It's kind of annoying, but overall a pleasant thing. Truth about the hate is, I welcome it here. And let me explain. It doesn't matter if people come to my channel to give positivity or negativity, I'm either entertaining others in ways that are good or bad, and I find it beneficial to my channel. I've always been a smaller YouTuber, I never passed over 400 subs in my life on any channel I've ever made, and that's the truth. Let me move on to my explanation. When people come here to dislike my content and not watch it for a long length of time, they think they are ruining my day by dislike bombing videos and spreading hate. They aren't. It does not matter if they click on the video and watch for less than a second, it will automatically give me a view to my video. That's a good thing, meaning my content is getting more popular over time. Thanks to those who attempt to spread hate, you are simply boosting my content throughout the algorithm. The big thing about people who are hateful towards your channel is they always come back and hold grudges, even if you got cancelled for something big or small. Which I've never gotten cancelled at all. I've been mentally unwell for well over five years, but I've never done anything to actually get hate except for a few small beefs with people on TikTok or people on YouTube. I have quite a few examples, but my biggest and most recent example is a content creator known as Salt My Fries 2, or whatever you'd like to call him. I don't know much about him, personally, at this point, and I don't know him and the stupid thing I did was speak negatively on his video and I didn't use my head. It was honestly stupid of me. Because he's a 15 year old who purposefully put my name in his videos to try to get hate pushed on me. Unfortunate, yes. But the people who were diehard fans of his that occasionally came back to hate on me are only boosting my content throughout the algorithm, and they don't comment. They mainly come here to dislike my content and leave. Reason I feel like they don't comment is because they like to remain anonymous to me. I don't know if it's out of fear or pity, but that's on them. It's not my problem at this point. Also, what happened between me and Salt My Fries 2 is in the past. I let it go and it was... A very stupid situation and if anyone wants a story time from my perspective feel free to comment if you were interested down in the comment section i will gladly discuss it because you have to take the negativity with a grain of salt and learn and adapt from it so i don't know about him if he hates me tries to joke around in an attempt to hurt my feelings for a 15 year old kid it's unfortunate because i shouldn't even matter to him but if i do like i said it's not my problem nor will it ever be again. I've moved on from the hatred I got. It started November through December of 2021 and kind of keeps going from time to time, but it's not as common as it was. For some reason though, when this hate came to be, I did let it affect me and I regret that. There is no reason for me to care, but I did. <clears throat> I kept worrying about the dislike button and this and that, when, one, dislikes shouldn't affect people from watching my content, it just shows some people feel negative of me. And two, YouTube made a decision to no longer keep dislikes viewable to the public people on YouTube. Unless you are just using a Google Chrome Store add-on to see them, the majority of people can't even see them anymore. Meaning those attempting to dislike bomb my content kinda just look dumb. And I know that sounds mean or rude, but it's the truth. But as long as those people are happy with the fact they dislike my content, good for them. But I just wanted to talk about this. Truth is, it's a big reason I wanted to take a big break from YouTube back in January of this year. I just never said that. I didn't want those people to know they were winning due to my mental state. But a few months have passed and I'm happier and a little bit stronger and I shouldn't let stupid things like that bother me. The bullying those people tried are no longer going to phase me whenever I upload. I'm going to upload for me and the people that enjoy my content as mediocre as my content may be. But this is all I've really had to say. I hope you all enjoyed. Feel free to like the video if you enjoyed. Dislike if you didn't or dislike if you're a troll or a bully or whatever. I don't care. You're 
assisting me either way, meaning I'm thankful for you being here, no matter what you do. Feel free to comment, subscribe if you are interested, and that's all I gotta say, so thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.